What's going on guys, Scar here, and today I recently returned to the Friday the 13th game. If you guys don't know, they actually made that, and to be honest, now that I'm thinking about it, even though I'm late to the game, because it came out in 2017, even though I'm late to the game and, you know, there's hacked lobbies and sometimes there could be two Jasons, I actually just got into a game with two Jasons earlier, but, um, even though I'm late, I feel like this game had... This game had a lot of potential, but obviously, if you guys don't know, the whole franchise of Friday the 13th had a lot of legal trouble, and uh, I'm not going to get into it, but you know, it had a lot of trouble that kind of ruined the franchise, and it kind of held back what, how good it could have been, and it was good, even though all the legal trouble, but uh, I actually, if you guys don't know, I ordered for my birthday, I, I ordered the Friday the 13th collection, and I'm on the fifth movie actually so i'm watching all that i got a few other movies but yeah i've been playing a bit of dead by daylight inside but i've mainly been moving to friday the 13th even though there's hacked lobbies it's still pretty fun i mean you know when you're talking to people i mean i don't usually talk in game chat because most of the people are idiots uh no offense but <laughs> there are some groups online whatever platform you're on that you can use to go on and they can arrange like a team session so like you don't have to play against these hacked lobbies and against two jasons all the time you can play with just normal people at any time you like you can join the group um there's some on pc xbox i don't know about playstation i don't think it was that big on playstation but i mean it's still a pretty fun game if you guys are looking for like this game isn't all about mainly about progression that's more dead by daylight dead by daylight has more progression and more rewards and stuff like that but in this game it's more like just a fun game you can play with friends and if you die it doesn't really matter because you're still gonna have fun with your friends if you're jason and you're decent then you know you'll still have fun like it's like dead by daylight if you get a few kills in a match it'll, you'll still have some satisfaction from getting like half the xp you would have gotten but you have like usually seven to eight players a game and you can just have fun with friends and the game's actually five dollars right now so if you guys want to it's five dollars every dlc is a dollar and the game is ending next year like right at the end of next year so unfortunately that will be gone so you have about a year and a half almost to continue playing this game or go buy it because it's pretty cheap and i recommend it to anyone who's looking for a game to play with friends uh so if you are looking for like a party type game because that's kind of what it is it's like just a game you can just chill out you can get drunk i mean i don't drink but you know what i mean uh <laughs> i've seen a lot of people get drunk playing this game and it's really funny but i recommend it to anyone who is looking for a game and dead by Daylight's it's fun too but in my opinion i think friday the 13th is a bit more fun more than like just like this game was broken in some ways and very very glitchy but i think overall this game was more fun than dead by daylight but i think dead by daylight ha is like the best because it has like every aspect in one game this game is just for fun and i think you know and you have all the stuff unlocked they gave you the highest level xp they give you all the perks at the highest rarity they give you um what else do they give you? Uh, that's basically it, but <laughs> it's, you know, it's fun. You get all the Jasons as well, so you can choose which Jason you want, and I realize this, you, each Jason has a certain play style, depending on each movie, so whatever part you want to play as, whatever part from whichever Jason, whatever, they have certain, uh, uh, ups and downs that make them good in some cases some that make them bad like if you want to be a faster one you can if you want to be in the water or something like they all have their they all have their quirks but yeah so the texas chainsaw massacre game is coming in 27 days i think if i saw i saw i get reddit posts every day from that reddit and they say they have the countdown i'm pretty sure today was 27 days so I'm pretty excited. It's coming soon, and uh, it's going to be around the second to last week of summer, so I'm going to have to put a lot of time in, but I'll still be able to put time in and get gameplay during uh, when school starts again. I'm going into high school, by the way, so yeah, and I'm 15. I just turned 15. My uh, birthday was the 21st, which was three, three days ago, yeah, um, but so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it's kind of short but i wanted to kind of give you guys an update on 
the Friday the 13th game, it's definitely a lot more enjoyable if you have friends, you know, that, you know, if you are looking for a game to play with a bunch of people, I totally recommend this game. It's a t shit ton of fun, and I might even stream it eventually before the game ends because I'm still playing it right now, but I want to kind of play it a bit more before Texas Chainsaw Massacre because honestly, Gun makes some pretty good games. They made this, and unfortunately, the franchise had a big downfall, but I think the Texas Chainsaw Massacre will somehow fix some of the mistakes that this game had and make it Texas Chainsaw Massacre themed, which I like, but I do like Jason a lot. And friday the 13th in general so and i also have to finish the movies i'm like almost halfway through all the movies and uh yeah so hope you all enjoyed thank you for watching leave a like subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video peace